it seems everybody is jumping into augmented reality. Whether it's Google and their new glasses, or HP and a little company they bought recently named Orasma. I took a tour around San Francisco with Orasma to see how they're inventing new ways for you and I to see the world a little differently. Essentially what we can do is take our phones, our tablet computers, and point at a photograph, an image, an object. It could be out in the real world, it could be a sculpture, and bring it to digital life. What you first see, there's just so much more than meets the eye. That is super yeah. cool. Can we do it again? Yeah, I love the yeah, little yeah. rocket ship. It's so adorable. Mm -hmm. Now that rocket looks kind of lame because it's just sitting there. There are a bunch of those around San Francisco. There like, are. Can you give me some spoilers? What are some <laughs> of the other ones? Well, we're going to go see some more. It's like Hogwarts. This is Hogwarts. <laughs> My little friend. <laughs> you didn't even know this guy was in here. Behind the scenes, the software on your phone or tablet is using increasingly impressive image recognition technology to identify real-world objects and then overlay that with digital content. So it's like the new QR code. You basically, you don't need to put that black and white square on your thing. You can actually just have the image as it is, recognize it, and then bring you to whatever digital content you want to play. Like me, don't here. Don't die, don't die, don't die. All right, ready? Yeah. Duck. Oh. Aha, I survived the Thundercats. Now it's still pretty early in the augmented reality game, but the possibilities seem endless, as long as we're all willing to walk around like this. Look, he almost swiped our guy. <laughs> Qualcomm's Viewphoria is also experimenting with augmented reality from games to advertising to movie tie-ins. And I have to admit, it was pretty fun walking around and seeing Iron Man appear in the most random so of places. Can, so Iron Man is tagged here, he but is. you could have him anywhere? Yes, so within the app, we've got a library of images and objects and characters yeah. that you can create and put anywhere you want in the world. It's up to you to put it wherever you want. Oh, here he comes. There oh, we go. Yes. <laughs> that is Iron that's Man. That's what I'm talking about. See, now this, too, is a vision of the future, the part where people walk by us and we're just staring at the phone and the wall and they're They don't like, realize what they're missing what out on. Yeah. Dude, big Iron Man's words. Ah. He's pretty ripped in that suit. I love this new world. Overall, I gotta say, the tech is pretty cool, but I can't help thinking it would be even more awesome with those Google Glasses, some contacts, or dare I say it, eye implants? Right now, it's using the smartphones and the tablets to get you there. We see ourselves with, with some sort of glasses or contacts, that sort of thing, yeah. where you're truly interacting much more naturally. Yeah, I know, it's a little scary, but hey. <laughs> I'm like, I always want to find the implant. I'm ready.